Oh. Okay, we have to get this out of the way. Oscar de la Renta. Oh no, I wasn't even gonna ask what you're oh. wearing. I was gonna do the iconic handshake from the show, Wolfpack. Oh, what's the iconic oh, right oh, 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 yeah. <laughs> I've seen the show, I swear I've seen the show, yes. <laughs> Congrats on the show. Should we start with, you know, a little lion's breath? So you want to stick out your tongue and okay. just let out all your breath. So <sighs> your tongue's got to be out fully. <sighs> I had to do those on the ride here to make sure the anxiety went away. Congrats on the show. The fact that there are so many ship edits already out there. What do you make of this? I support all the ships that have been on Twitter. Luna is very much alive in real life, so I love that people are excited about that. I know there's Bluna, Blake and Luna. That's a big one. Can we talk about Bluna? I am talking about Bluna. Like, I'm kind of rooting for it, but don't tell Jeff. I would ship, what do they call it, Everlyn? Harlan and Armani's character? I definitely ship Everett and Blake. Definitely Blake and Everett are, are my favorite ship, but Tyler and uh, a guy named Zach Nelson might have something going on later in the series as well. Someone who's got your back, Sarah Michelle Geller. she really wanted to create a safe space for all of you guys on set. How has she helped you and mentored you through this? It's really nice having her by my side because she can teach me how to stand up for myself in this industry. She wanted us to remember to stay kind, gracious, humble. Treat everyone the same. Treat everyone with respect because, you know, they're giving you this. The cast was just telling me how you would tell them, stay grounded, be grateful, be humble. Was that always your mindset in this industry? It should be. Just because I do what I do, it doesn't make me different from anybody else. I just have success in what I do, but it doesn't make you any less passionate in what you do or you any less passionate in what you do. We're all here just trying to do our job. What is your favorite SMG project? <sighs> I think Buffy. Oh, Buffy. Buffy, obviously. Buffy had paved the way for Teen Wolf, for Alice and Argent, for so many women out there, heroines. We owe her a lot. Buffy was so iconic, but she was amazing in Cruel Intentions. I would definitely have to say Cruel Intentions. Oh, Cruel Intentions. I love Cruel Intentions. Cruel Intentions. Wow, well, that's what a lot of you guys have been saying. We made the boys watch Cruel Intentions as soon as we found out she was doing the show. And I watch it all the time when I need a good sexy drama to oh, watch. Yeah. Uh, it's hot. Oh, it is. And she's so hot in it. Uh, I tell her that all the time. Probably makes her uncomfortable. And I asked everyone what was their favorite project of yours. A lot of people said Cruel Intentions. And so we have to know what happened to Catherine's Crucifix. Probably in a prop house at Sony somewhere. I actually don't know. We need to get our hands on that thing. Yeah, right?